So today I'm going to be showing you how I make some truffle butter. Uh, we might just go through everything that I've got here first. Uh, I've got some uh, salted butter here, which is I have let get to room temperature. We have just a small grater to obviously grate the truffle. Uh, the chopping board, we have some pink salt to add to the truffle uh, and the butter once we mix it all. Gloves, important to use for when handling the truffle, it's very strong uh, and has a lot of aroma to it. Uh, we've got a container to put in the, the, the truffle butter once we finish wrapping it. We've got some baking paper, baking paper is to lay the, the butter, we'll lay a strip of butter with the truffle in it uh, on this paper and then we'll roll it up and then the glad wrap will wrap over it just to seal it. So, firstly, uh, we've got some truffle from the truffle farm here at Majura. Uh, local farm, really good truffle. Uh, we have uh, quite a bit of truffle here, actually. We have a really big truffle. I'm making a kilo of truffle butter. Now, the rule of thumb is normally about 5% of the total volume you would use actually in truffle. Uh, so a kilo, you would have about 50 grams, right? Uh, today, however, I have 90 grams. Uh, a really large truffle. Um, I'll see how we go. I might use it all, or I might just leave a little bit left over so we can use it for other things. But um, beautiful truffle uh, from the Duro. Truffle farm. Butter, room temperature, very good. Chuck on some gloves on. Make sure you get powderless gloves, uh, particularly if you're handling food, you don't want uh, the gloves with white powder on it, powderless. Truffle. So I'll just grate some truffle now, uh, and I'll just see how much of it I'm going to use. So I've just grated the whole 90 grams of the, of the truffle at the stage because I've put it all in this truffle butter. We're going to make some butter, uh, make some logs out of it uh, and then put it in the freezer and freeze it. And then when I want to use it, all I need to do is cut off a, a, a slab, a section of it that I want to use uh, and then I just use that in my cooking like uh, for potatoes, mashed potatoes really nice in it. Uh, or even a nice little slither of the uh, truffle butter on top of the steak, melt over top of it, beautiful. The smell of it, amazing. So, what I'll do is I'll add this truffle to the butter, uh, mix it through lightly, you don't want to be too rough with it. Uh, I'll add a little bit of pink salt just for extra enhanced flavours, just a little bit more. Then once we've done that, we'll put the rolls on the baking paper, We'll roll it up, glad wrap it, and freeze it. Now that uh, we have completed 
the truffle butter we've made that today. Uh, we're putting the fro in the freezer and it has frozen uh, just enough. What we'll do is we'll use it. So I have some fresh spinach, just cut up some fresh spinach, got some mushrooms, garlic, truffle butter. What I'm just going to do is fry off some mushrooms, uh, add some garlic, add the spinach, that will wilt enough just with the heat, a little bit of olive oil uh, and garlic, and then add the truffle butter. Put it in the wok, cook it for a couple of minutes, dish it up on the plate with some fish, beautiful.